Lawmakers and the Budget Committee of Parliament met with officials from the Finance Ministry to discuss the budget estimates of the 2017-2018 financial year. One of the concerns they raised about the 6 billion shillings allocated for constructing a kilometer of a road in the Albertine region. In the world, you can justify that. The second thing you are going to, you need to, 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 to expound on is the absorption capacity. If in a year you are going to do this volume of work, why don't you request money for that volume of work? The State Minister of Finance, David Bahati, defended the budget, arguing that it would enable the quick transportation of products. But his attempts of convincing the committee about the future availability of resources once the oil generation is up and running did it amount to much. We want to achieve the production of oil by 2020. Because here in the age parliament, you say by 2009, you would have oil. This is the subject, the infrastructure, which is required for the oil production. It is not possible. We interacted with uh, officials from the oil company. They actually say the earliest, the earliest people we are lucky in this country to see oil here. Is 20, 27. Stop a lot. This man in the environment, we're supposed to give you a certificate to start producing this oil. It's not facilitated. Another sticky issue was the proposal to construct an airport for the transportation of logistics in Kabale village, Hoima district. The minister told the committee that part of the funds would come from the British government. We are, we are borrowing, we are being supported by the British government. Uh, how about international airport is here? It cannot make an airport. How are you going to spend it when it is not appropriated by Parliament? Incorporated within our what? Our budget. Uh, budget. Because we know the how much we are going to pay. And they have said that the, the, the British people have read it. I'll read. He also told the committee that they would invite the Lion Ministry and the Uganda National Roads Authority to respond to their queries. But most of the details of the cost per kilometer can be better answered uh, by Minister of Work and, and General. Meanwhile, the MPs raised concern over the government's proposal to spend over a billion shillings from the Petroleum Fund to fund the construction of the roads in the oil-rich region. We do not indicate it. But in the budget estimates, in the budget estimates, if you can uh, look at the resources that we, we gave you, the resource envelope, we clearly indicate that we are utilizing 33 million US dollars, which is equivalent to 125 billion from the oil fund for purposes of financing the infrastructure for oil. The committee is set to make its report and recommendations in regard to the presentation of the finance ministry. More research all in TV at Parliament. Ten. Ten.